I'm changing and it's for the better. It's all about growth. How am I supposed to show you my now if I don't show you my beginning from where I started? The truth, the real side of me, so I can always stay real. to get to this point. Walking, walking, walking from class, walking everywhere. Just very active. I did not know I was changing and losing weight until people around me start to notice and like, they're asking me, what is your secret? Seriously, there's no secret. It's all just me. I was doing the same thing, but I was active while I was doing it walking, walking, exercising, going from point A to point B, finding my way around classes, walking from home to school. I did not focus on diet plans and checking my steps. I did not even focus on my weight loss. I did not even know how much weight I was losing because counting, counting all of this was not even necessary. I was focused on just doing what I have to do, which is living, living in the moment, but actually being healthy at the same time. And if you're just focusing on all of this, you might just fail if you just keep Counting calories, I've seen people fail at this. Do not let society dictate how you should look and how you should feel. It's all up to you, how you want to be, who you are. Yes, the gym has changed my life in the past two years. I never even knew anything about the gym, but it has changed my life a bit. Now I go to the gym, clear my head. It feels good. It makes me happy. It's my safe spot. If I'm upset, if I'm angry, if... I'm stressed, or even if I'm happy, I just go there and just, it's a good place to be. I'm not trying to build muscle. Oh, everyone is afraid of this. No, I'm not trying to build muscle. I basically toned my body. I'm not trying to build the muscle, but it's me. And I don't care how everyone thinks. This is who I am. I'm Caribbean Jewel, thanks for watching. Jules, Jules, Jules. The reason why I made this video is because of my my success in the weight loss. I was not really thinking about weight loss when I first started to lose weight. It just happened naturally. I personally don't think anyone should take the whole weight loss thing. I mean, should take it serious, but if you're counting calories and all this stuff, to me, personally, you won't really lose weight. I didn't really lose weight, counting calories and all this. It was just natural. I was walking every day. I was very active, up and down, moving, moving. Um, and 
everywhere I go, it was just walking to every place here, I was just walking. And it wasn't until I keep walking months later, I noticed that people were saying, you're losing weight. My classmates were like, you're really losing weight. And I'm like, I don't even notice it because I'm not thinking about losing weight. And I don't know how to explain this to you guys that if you're counting calories, I, see, I met people that are counting what they need to lose and everything and they're not really losing weight. And for me, it just started to happen naturally that and I, I wasn't even intending on losing weight. I just knew I needed to be healthy. And I would walk a lot. It's just like I'm burning off that fat. And I would eat like normal things, fried rice, um, fried dumplings here in China, different normal things. And I was big before. I was very shy in bringing out this video because of how I looked before. I never used to take photos at all when I was um, fat, but the insecurities are really real. It's really, really real. And I had to grow from that. And I'm, I'm not saying that I'm still like like proud, because we as women, we're never really satisfied with our bodies, and this is it's a fact. Um, but you have, to, I realize, you have to be happy with who you are. And now I'm starting to just accept who I am and how I look now and work on how I look and just be happy with that. Who doesn't like it, doesn't like it. Who likes it, likes it. it it's not for them, it's for me. And it's about my health. But weight loss is just put up to that person. You, could, you have beautiful women that are big, you have beautiful women that are skinny. There's beauty, beauty comes in all shapes and sizes. So for me personally, um, it's not really about the weight loss and I just insecurity doesn't change because I still feel insecure even as I'm this size now and sometimes I feel down about myself I feel like okay I'm not beautiful enough and I have like to push myself and be like okay you could do better than this you're you you're beautiful because of who you are not how you look and the insecurities do creep in and that's just life and there's no way to block it. But I, I, since I started in the gym, I never used to um, be in the gym before. Before you start in the gym, at least get a trainer so you know how to use these equipments and everything. I worked with a, a team. I worked with, um, I had a partner, gym partner before, and she helped me with knowing more about the equipments I'm using and everything. That's, that's how I became better at using the materials here in the gym and I moved from one gym to another gym and then I started to enjoy the gym when I'm angry when I'm feeling sad it's a good way to vent it's a really really good way to clear your mind so if you feel like this, there's something instead of going to drink or something like this or eating junk food um, you could use the gym and clear your head it, it does help it truly does help it's distracting when you focus on something you're punching a bag or you're just lifting a weight. I'm not like that person that's trying to get thick or like have a, a goal, a body goal. I'm just doing it just because it helps me mentally. It really helps me mentally. I don't know about anybody else. It helps me mentally. And it's not like the body thing is like a big deal until I notice that it's helping me mentally. So and what the most important thing is that you enjoy doing it. Enjoy and love it. Just love it and be in the moment of it. And clear your head. It, the insecurities will keep creeping, but I enjoy what I'm doing in the gym, and that's honest. I would hope to at least show more things. I've learned a lot about my body as, I, as time went along over the years, and it took me, I was 206 pounds, and then I lost weight. I don't even know how much I'm, I am now, but, that's not even that important, that's my point. I lost weight where I could be healthy enough and well, I'm not even fat, like, I'm sure my cholesterol is, is even intact, so it's okay. So if you're counting like this, don't, don't be stressed out about your weight, do it for you. And that's all I wanted to say. Thank you for watching this video. Just like and subscribe and hit that bell button and share the video out. If, if you need motivation, share it to your friend. If, if you need the truth, this is the truth. This is really, this is what's real.
you don't have to push for something that's not really there. Push for you. Be happy in what you're doing. It's not like I'm trying to look like a man or something. People will have their comments, but do it for you. Thank you for watching.